Hi folks. What we're looking at here is a $2 cordless electric drill. I bought it at a yard sale today for $2 uh, with the charger and the battery and it works. And that's all well and good but it just so happens that I'm not going to use it for that purpose I'm going to take it apart and use the switch to see if I can control the speed of my electric motor. Uh, it's, uh, it's hard to say if it'll work or not. It could very well fry that switch. If it does, I'm out two dollars. And also, I'm out a working uh, electric drill because it does work but it also came with an electric saw and uh, I have a use for that saw so we're gonna tear apart this unit here and see what we get so I've got it apart here and it's it's pretty simple and uh, before I forget I want to mention that this is a 14.4 volt uh, adjustable adjustable speed drill and I'm going to run uh, almost 26 volts through it so the chances are high that this will not work uh, it's hard to say I'm not real confident that this is going to work but I saw another YouTube video, and I would mention the guy's name if I could remember, but I can't. But he, um, he did this on an electric bike, and it did work. So that's what gave me the idea to try this. So I am going to try this, and we'll see what happens. So step one is to uh, see if it'll even power this this cordless drill and control the speed so I'm going to flip on the power here and I don't see any smoke and I don't hear any funny noises so that works and that's the good news. So I think I can control the motor speed with this and we're going to find out in a minute. So now I've got it all connected up and we're going to give it a try. I'm just going to slowly speed this up and go slow or I can go fast. That's full speed there. Gradually back down on it. And there you have it. That's about what I can do with it. It's not bad really. I'm I'm pleased with that, I really am. That would absolutely work. So that's really uh, that's really it. Thanks for watching.